by using this type of system, we're eliminating the waste of defects. So there's lots of things to turn on and off in the morning, like each one of these mist away coolant, uh, mist away collectors, mist collectors has a power plug. So at the end of the day, we're going around unplugging each one at the beginning of the morning, plugging each one. Our vent fans, every morning we'd have to come over, plug it in. And it was crazy. And like at the end of the day, like uh, we try and at four o'clock, our energy rates like quadruple. It's pretty crazy. So you can tell in winter when a dude left a heater on like by his stand because it's pulling like, I don't know how many watts. And you'll see a spike in the weekends like, hey dude, you owe the company $25 for keeping your fan or your heater on. Like I haven't done that, but that's what it would cost to forget to turn something off. So like, for example, we've got all of our, uh, this app that we happen to use, not endorsing or anything like that, but it has everything, every plug that needs to go on and off in the entire shop. And it turns on automatically and it turns off automatically. So like, here's one. Uh, the accumulator conveyor right there is plugged into a circuit that can go on and off. What's another one? Uh, oh, our coffee maker, like you shouldn't leave, you know, inductive devices on. Uh, our laminator, so we have a little Amazon Basics laminator that we laminated a page, forgot to turn it off. We came in on the next morning, it was like brown because it had like heated and overheated the table behind it almost caught on fire. And so now when we turn it on, it turns off within 15 minutes. Little side story, it's just one of those things. Uh, okay, so if you watch those fans, lathe side roof fans, I tap that. And as you can see, they're decelerating, they're turning off. It's all that little stuff, you know? Why should we ever mess with that? Just, just make things automatic, mill side roof fans, yeah. All those little things it's so we didn't come in and say hey we got to automate all this it was like huh what's one thing that bugs us that's kind of a process defect that we could employ some type of technology or a different process to make this problem go away smart plugs 